It's Essa Barrett and I'm going to walk you through my in-depth skincare routine and everyday makeup tutorial. My first step is cleansing oil. I use this one. I've been obsessed with Korean skincare recently. I use these biodegradable individual face towels. I use this little bar of soap. It's a sulfur soap, anti-acne. Recently, I had a pretty bad breakout for the first time in my life and it got me to really start taking good care of my skin. I've done a lot of research and uh, double cleansing seems like the best thing. This is the Dr. Dennis Gross Extra Strength Daily Peel. It's two steps. Uh, the first one is exfoliating. I've been using them for three years. I have a bad problem that once my skin looks flawless and is good, I kind of just give up on the skincare. I get lazy. When I start breaking out and struggling again, I go back to these and they save my life. Now it's time for the second one. You're supposed to wait two minutes. This one's the anti-aging neutralizer. Toner. I use two. First one that I use is this Paula's Choice Exfoliate Skin Perfecting Toner. Relief Toner. This again is one of my K Beauty products. Rose Water Spray. I use this to rehydrate my face because the next step I need a moist face for snail mousse. I feel like it has helped my skin so much. Dr. Dennis Gross Texture Renewal Serum. This one specifically is for acne prone skin. Kiehl's Eye Cream. Sunscreen. Since I've gotten into self-care, I feel like the biggest change and the most helpful thing that I've done has been no social media. Being a young girl, um, social media is kind of like a big thing and like I grew up on it and so it was hard for me to admit that it was something that I need to let go of but once I did my life changed my last step of skincare is aquaphor and sometimes when I don't have hairspray for the see flyaways on my hair like that this is a little hack which I learned in like middle school because I used to put like chapstick on just put aquaphor on it and it it goes away. Now we're on my self-care journey. So I'm gonna show you the supplements that I take. My first step is the brows. I use this Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel. I love the 90s brows and sometimes I will pluck way too much. My stage makeup tour has changed so much. Recently, it's kind of gone from casual and comfortable outfits and bold makeup to bold outfits and natural makeup. Every time I'm on stage and I wear like my tour outfits, I feel like I step into this like alter ego I call baby cowboy. <laughs> I go in with this random freckle pen. Sometimes I'll bring out my moles on my face a little bit and then, do you see this pimple right there? I mean, sometimes I would put like concealer on it and then literally you can make it into a freckle. Contour powder kit uh, by Anastasia. Just do a teeny dab and all of the ones down here. Dab it there, make a straight line. And it like lifts it 
a little bit my favorite blush. I first go in with the Benetint, tint, especially being blonde now. I love that sun-kissed look. Dior blush looks so cute. This next step that I do, I feel like makes my natural makeup almost look more glam and it's all about the lips. I use two lip liners. I go in with the intense. I go directly on the line. My lips were so thin. Growing up when I would smile, I'd have no lip. The second I turned 17, I got lip filler. Then over time, I became insecure about my lip filler. Now I feel very pleased with them. The lighter pillow talk and I kind of just fill in my whole lip and kind of blend in the darker one. been very inspired by 90s makeup and um, 90s fashion and just the 90s in general. When I'm getting ready before a show, I listen to music, but at home doing my makeup, I kind of just like peace and quiet. I feel like it's just like me time. For a show, I kind of listen to a lot of things. It ranges from like the craziest genres ever. You gotta go like calm, chill, girly vibes, and then like full on energy, heart pumping music. Sometimes even my own. <laughs> the last step is perfume. I use a hair perfume first. Baccarat Rouge. This one is my baby. It is my scent. It has been for years. I have many stories where people have been looking for me and they just follow my scent. You just want to drown in it. This was so much fun. I hope you like my new wellness routine and try it for yourself. Love you. Bye.